te kry en kry en reis begin, dan moet ons maar net uitkoot kan nie verstaan ek gaan om afval van reis sêke reis af van custom Ek kan nog steeds nie select Pek tyd nie Ek weet nie Ja Yes Ok, ek gaan Welcome everyone, Hello, thank you guys for joining. Sorry we are a bit late today. Um, there is some complications regarding everything. Uh, uh, for some reason it doesn't want to allow me and Reaper to spectate. So we're going to go race and then uh, we will quit our to spectate. Okay, uh, I believe everyone is ready. Yeah, it looks like everybody's uh, on and ready up. That's it. We can go. Yeah, hundred percent. Okay, let's go. Let's get these guys racing. Oh, come. On. That's why we can't spectate because I haven't loaded the, <laughs> <laughs> the track yet. Oh my well freaking soul! We are under a well. lot of pressure to. <laughs> And now we can speak <laughs> to it. <laughs> okay, oh, well, <laughs> just for the next one. Okay, 34 laps, hypercars, 3 pit stops. Okay, and uh, just to make sure, it's relation, everything is like it's supposed to be, except for this. Um, Guys, let's be loading one more thing and there we go. Go. 34 laps, 3 puts. Now we can begin the launch. <laughs> I feel like such a noob now. Ah. Uh, it happens. Uh, yes, at I do. Uh, I've got you in the stream, I've got myself in the stream. The other night uh, we were doing Formula One and. Um, I was uh, spectating and commentating on my own and then the one guy crashed out so I thought okay you know what um, I'll invite him to go commentate with me and what I never checked was um, I didn't unmute uh, the party in the stream so I was having a complete conversation <laughs> with myself basically okay everyone is ready <laughs> up you need to spectate um, while you're racing. Am I? Okay, I'm spectating. Are you spectating? <laughs> yes, I'm on. Okay. Oh. Oh, it starts fun. It's a fun race. Finally. Okay, I'm going to start and spectate on Buck Doom from fifth position. We've got 13 guys racing today. 
And a big welcome big back to Uncle Folly, the legend oh, yes, himself. the legend is back. Uh, it's good to see him back on track again. I'll start. I need on, to start race. On pole position. <laughs> I need to start. I'll race. start on pole and then watch from there. <laughs> no, hundred percent. And we're off to the races. Yeah, black screen for now. Okay, and off we go. So far, so good down the straight. We've got Bucktum oh, late on the brakes, Buck going oh. for the inside a bit wide. Why? Managed to uh, keep it going. Um, Drop back to third. We've got some guys, or oh, someone that went wide, batted zero, went with wide on the grass. At least he's still going. We've got Wasim, good to see him back as well. He's back out of hospital, the racing again. It's good to have him here as well. Let's see, these guys are keeping it very clean. Red Severin and uh, Wasim, and we've got two guys on the grass on the outside. That's the back, uh, yes. That was a blue Ferrari, and um, I'm trying to see it. Oh, and it's Justin, batted zero, and Justin KD <laughs> out oh, on the so I grass. Can't see, I can't see batted anymore. He was in fourth position. Batted is now all the way down to 13th. So he needs to get his way back up again. Uh, Justin, hey, Yui, how are you doing? Remington, thank you guys for joining the stream. I know it's very late and we do apologize for the technical gad. It seems that we had a lot of um, Xbox issues and also um, party issues. Yeah. But that's sorted now. And it's good to have these guys racing finally. And uh, we've got Uncle Folly finding himself now in 11th place uh, between Justin and uh, David. David, oh, Justin going on the inside of Uncle Folly. Has okay, so jumping to oh, the front. Oh, somebody again. off there at the back. <laughs> Dude, yeah, you're telling me about the Gremlins. Oh, we've got Gerard Bess sure. leading the race for now in his uh, Lamborghini. Lamborghini looking strong, keeping it clean. I think like the first the... three are going to start pressurizing each other now. Wasim's going to join the party just now. I'm currently on uh, Alberts. Alberts will also want to join those three at or four at the front. Uh, he should be getting involved pretty soon. So, so far the person, yeah, Dewey, welcome back to Uncle Folly, good to have him back, yes, that is so true. Um, so far the person that is, uh, has lost out the most from the start is Buck He's uh, finding oh, himself, uh, he's in 8th place, are you thinking eighth. of uh, Battered. Uh, <laughs> Battered Zero? <laughs> yes. And then we've, uh, uh, both starts with a beard, same, same. And we've got Bloodsaint, uh, Bucktoom hitting the back of Bloodsaint and then uh, stopping to uh, let him go again. That is caused um, Dana oh, to Dreaded catch up. Severin. Or oh, Dread Severin going a bit wide. Yes, Aster, it's uh, good to see Wasim also back on track. He's uh, out of hospital. Oh, contact. Contact Alberton was seen. I I'm jumping on board with that seen. battle now. Let's see what's happening. I was following on Alberts, but a contact there and was Are seen. Are we losing lost someone? I'm having Some. a black screen here. Same, yeah. Justin BK. Oh, Justin DNF. Oh, oh, oh that is unfortunate. Okay. Well, Ezekiel scored. He's up to fourth. <laughs> one man's uh, bread is another. What? One man's dead is another man's one bread. Man's eh? <laughs> bread, yes. 
Now Albert's finding himself now in fifth place, having to catch up to the guys again. Ezekiel currently fourth. Uh, this means Buck Team is now currently in sixth place, so he's uh, gaining those places back again. Was seen finding himself now all the way down in seventh. From fourth yes, all the way down to seventh. That is so unfortunate. And we I see we had um, someone in the pit uh, that was uh, batted zero that was in the pit. Probably from that first lap incident. Yes, we've got Dread Server in it that's uh, finding him currently in second place. He managed to get past um, Swartwolf. Swartwolf. Oh. Great uh, Severin trying well, to Gerard go on the inside, inside of Gerard. Let's see what's happening on the main straight. I believe the um, Lambo should have the legs on the Ferrari. Should have. Should have the better top pain. But it depends, depends on, on who gets the better drive. Out of the final corner, that's correct. And so far, it looks like Dread Severin has got the, the legs. Very evenly matched. See, as they get Towards to... Towards the end, the Lambo's going. Yeah, you can see that gap just increasing by the end of the straight. And on the corners, the Ferrari is back on him again. These Ferraris are strong in the corners, though. Yeah, it's a very good car. Okay, it looks like there's a nice battle between Ezekiel and Albert's going on. I'm dropping back to that quick. Both in the Ferrari. Albert, Albert's having a look down the inside, Albert's deciding not to take it. Two of a second behind him, that's correct, it's very close. And we've got blood stained on the back of Battered Zero as well, so I'm going to quickly jump on board with that one as we see some action on the top three as well. This is getting very close. And uh, Swartwolf actually getting past Dread Sever in there. And Bloodstained also finding himself uh, in 11th place now, ahead of Battered Zero. He made uh, quick work of that. And good to see Dana do as well, uh, back in, uh, Up in 6th, yes. Uh, in 6th place, a very sixth old uh, driver for all of this, and he's uh, mainly in the Formula 1 league now. But it's good to see him still practicing and uh, participating in the Formula League. Uh, good that the guys are trying both sides. Like it. Oh, Buck going sideways, losing out to Wasim. No contact, clean pass. Now, next for Wasim is uh, Dandadu pushing. And uh, we're seeing a gap form now between Dred Severin in third place and uh, Smart oh. Wolf. Wartwolf is now on the back of Harald Bez. Well, uh, Wasim lost it out of the last chicane into the straight and finds himself back down in eighth again and quite a distance behind seventh and sixth. The Wolf looking on the inside of Harald Bez. Let's see what happens here. On the outside the now. Oh! Bit wide, opening the gap up for Dred Severin. Woo, this is some close racing we have here. Oh, sorry, uh, Rico, you were busy saying about um, the legend. Mm, looked like he was in 10th and lost out a little bit. He's down in 11th now again. Oh. Okay, so, so far, uh, Dread Severin out. with the fastest level, 1 minute 46. It was uh, Gerard Best doing a good job of keeping um, Smart Wolf behind him. Oh, Dread Severin uh, <laughs> touching uh, Smart Wolf on the rear end there. Ah, oh, the folly. The legend go uh, taking uh, bet and zero on the outside. Oh, and brilliant racing. Ah, oh, unfortunately goes a little bit wide and loses traction. 
and yes. we see um, to stay in front. Great Severin yes. going up on the inside of the Swartz Wolf and then running a bit wide, giving the spot back to Swartz Wolf. Side by side through turn three. And coming up to turns four and five now. Gonna join the battle on you there. Swartz Wolf was still in second place for now. Uh, Dred Severin breaking very late, trying to go on the outside, but Swart Wolf uh, just a bit later on the brakes there. Oh, I have to say, Harrod Bez has been uh, managing to keep his nose clean and stay out front from lap one so far. For well, now, yes, that's a very good drive from him. We've got the Ferrari chasing okay. down. Yeah. The Senna here coming up to the very tight corner into the last sector now. A Dred Severin trying to look at the outside of Smart Wolf again, then switching up to the inside. Oh, and he's going up the inside, he's got it just before the chicane. Very good nice. I, move. I dropped. Done. I'm trying to get my map back. And now Dred Severin can go up and try and uh, take a uh, first place from from uh, Tarot Bez now. Well, I'm on Albert and uh, he's under a bit of pressure from Ezekiel. Going into turn one. Yeah, I'm going to jump on board with that battle now with Ezekiel. It I'm with like Albert's watching back from him. Both of these guys in the Ferrari F K. Let's see if Ezekiel can, can do anything about uh, Alberts in front of him. Just to let you guys know that um, currently on the championship standings we've got Ezekiel, Alberts and um, Baktoum equally Baktoum. on points, on 54 points each. Yes, Aester, it is be. very good racing from the top three. I have to say Ezekiel's Ferrari looks very loose though. Tell that be. I'm looking at that now. Yes, definitely a bit more tail happy than what he would want it to be. The bug doom finding himself now in seventh place. Trying to hunt down Wasim in front of him. Hmm? It's very good to see it's Uncle very... Folly back on the on the track again. And uh, he's done a very good job about delivery as well. He's got, uh, I mean, for a guy that just said this afternoon he's going to start uh, racing again tonight. Uh, it's good to see he's got everything sorted on his uh, on his car. So that's a good the, the determination that these guys are showing. It's uh, fantastic. Better Jero currently finding himself in 11th place. I have some, I managed to lose my map and struggling to get that back. Hey, <laughs> um, on the in general, so on the bottom left, um, you'll have your camera views, your uh, Drivers. Yes, yes. The racing flag is actually the map. 
So just hold A on yeah. that and then go to... Oh, I may need to change that to something else. <laughs> I went to race stats, that's why. Oh, okay. Okay, that makes it easier again. <laughs> I'm the noob. <laughs> yeah. um, I'm on board here with uh, David uh, or Divet that's finding himself in 10th place. And uh, dropping down to 9th place is Blood Saint, also in a Ferrari. Oh, contact. Red Severin and Gerard uh, Bez. Oh, but they're that's, okay. Okay, that's going to work in that's the favor one of Swartwolf now. Yes. And we've got oh. Danadu in, uh, running around in 8th place now in his blue Lamborghini. And Baktum still in in 7th place. Wasim still in 6th place. Not getting closer to uh, the top guys here. Uh, Yui, be between, interesting to see the between the aim guys, the fastest lap that I saw was a uh, one minute um, and it's tell you now it was oh, a one minute point have a look. six point seven. Looks like an Albert. Uh, it's actually one forty six three from Albert. Yeah, it was definitely 146.3 from Alberts and so far, fastest step. Oh, and we've got... Um, uh, a Dread Saver and Into Dread the Pits. Pits. Yeah, he's oh, currently he's Into the Pits. Left. Then, yeah, it's gonna be close now. I think the max so far was 12 laps, but pushing 12 laps on three pit stops is gonna be difficult. <laughs> no, it shouldn't. Um, I think I, I worked it out very nicely. They've got 15 laps to pit, and if they pit on the last lap, uh, they've got nine laps to get to the end. So uh, they should be able to make it quite comfortably. Pretty sure, yes. Oh, but also the AM class uh, don't have, they just have to make three pits. They That's don't have correct, yeah. Specific pit windows, oh yes. Current is coming up on Uncle Foley as a back marker. Okay, so we actually got the reason for Justin DK not finishing the race. It seems that his analog stick broke on his controller, so the car kept on turning one way. Ah, that's <laughs> It does. I've managed, well, I had to change my controller as well, because I got stick drift. My car just kept on going right, and I wanted to go left. Oh, so yeah, that is I understand. I get the feeling there, I understand. <laughs> I've batted zero in from 11. Seems like he got some damage because Karabez uh, was catching him at a rapid pace. That could be. Last oh, lap for 159. Yeah, so he probably lost it somewhere. Got a lot of damage. So Karabez is still staying out. Still not going into the pits. He's into his 11th lap now. Well, I've managed to uh, do some testing, finally. And <laughs> I actually got the Lycan up to 15 laps and still have some juice to go. Oh, that's good. That's very good. Yeah, some of these cars can actually go very far. I know on uh, Silverstone, the Ruggera could do almost 20 laps without needing to stop. So some of them can make it, some of them can't make it. See if we can get distances from leader. I've got Uncle Folly and Batter Zero left. 
And then Both uh, on a lap, yes. Uh, Swartwolf is six seconds behind Karad. Yes. Danadu is only two seconds behind Albert. Did Albert go into the pits or did he drop out somewhere and uh, lost some time? He managed to lose that. Okay, so Karad is, is comfortably on his own out in front at the stage. Then Swart, there's going, Karad going into the pits now. We've got Blood Saint just going past um, Danda Dude for sixth place. Blood Wolf also into the pits, it seems. It's okay, I'm gonna jump on board with uh, Dread Severin. I wanna see where he comes out. Um, or, and we'll see him in the pits as well. Yeah, we'll see him. Oh, well, we, we had um, Harald Bez also three. going into the pits. So I wanna see. Three in and Severin's in the down the straight, so he's. Up into first place. It looks like he is grabbing first place from Kharad. Side by side, basically. And as they come <laughs> out the pits. A Dread Severin got that position. Kharad B is now in the second place. So it's a good drive from Dread Severin. And Albert finds himself in third. But I think Albert still needs to pit. He needs to pit. Uh, oh, we lap 12. Although he is in the Ferrari, so he might have already put it. Because the Ferrari doesn't have the distance on, uh, or field distance as the rest of the cars. Well, let's see. Let's he see what might happens. Have already. He probably has to go put this lap. Hopefully we don't see another Silverstone for him. He, he basically kicked himself he, at uh, yeah, Silverstone got, because he got stuck with him. Bill. On the last straight of Silverstone, and he, by the time he got to the pit, he was two laps two down. Two laps down, yeah. I managed to watch the race <laughs> while sitting on the beach and uh, enjoying the fresh sea air, sea breeze. Good job, but I do take my hat off to him big. Yeah, Something some like guys. That happening and then he's still two laps down and still finishes the race. Yeah, there's some guys that will just uh, not uh, compete anymore, what? just quit the race. No uh, worth yes. in seeing <laughs> uh, still driving. Well, in doing and that, he's, he's done quite something for himself. He opens up some points. Yeah. Obviously, he got some more points than the other guys that DC'd. Yes, definitely. Yeah. Yeah, that definitely helped him a bit, and he's still staying out. Ooh. Let's hope his fuel gauge is working. Yeah, well, I, I really hope so too. If anyone is in the party with him, or <laughs> please have a chat with him, he's making us on our nerves here. Very <laughs> nervous, yeah. <laughs> I hate to see that happening to one driver. No, definitely. Well, I'm going to quickly bring up the the dash. Let's see. Well, I believe he might have put it. Because the Ferrari doesn't have the fuel range, just uh, the same fuel range as the rest of the car. Because it's showing basically. So uh, that's a good from him being down. And uh, but he was almost seven seconds behind the leaders. So. Yeah, this is good. Okay, so he's not making us nervous anymore. That's good to know. <laughs> okay, blood safe and swat fall on each other. Blood Satan took some serious damage if you have a look at his windscreen. Blood safe. Oh yeah, he's been oh, looking yeah. like that for a while now. He's on the back of Swart Wolf. Swart Wolf uh, was battling for the lead in the beginning. Oh, Blood Saint no, I'm talking going about, too wide. I'm talking about Swart Wolf's uh, windscreen. I'm okay. following him and looking back from him onto uh, Blood Saint. Oh, yeah, I'm seeing what you're saying. Definitely got some damage there. Looks like he had a very angry girlfriend close to his car or something. Hey, you never know, eh? <laughs> <laughs> so we've got uh, Albert still currently in third place, and Harold now finding himself down in second place. Second. And, uh, and Dread Seven comfortable. The Dread Seven has now put up an eight-second gap. Now the issue that um, 
Karol Bass has is that um, uh, Albert is uh, oh. not too far behind him. It's like 1.3 seconds. The only thing that might count in his favor is once again fuel range. The Ferrari can go quite a bit longer than the uh, well, the Lambo can go quite a bit longer than the Ferrari scan. Yes. Well, uh, well the thing is, I think uh, Alberts with clear air, he can put in the laps. Okay, so the f first place out ahead, quite comfortably, Dred Severin. Then we've got yeah, he's uh, Albert's. done a fastest lap with one forty five one. The others in front he's definitely put down a marker for everyone to chase. And then we've got Harad Brees and Albert's literally on each other. Yeah, Albert's is gonna try and go up the inside now of Harad. Let's see last couple of corners. Oh the drive once again. The best drive. Yeah, Karot <laughs> is getting a lot better drive out of the final corner there. Albert's not being able to capitalize on anything there due to the lack in, in top speed in the Ferrari. I'm gonna jump to Swartforth. Looks like the seems close to capture him pretty quickly. Albert's now putting on pressure on Gerard. Going up the outside into turn four. Not being able to make it. Oh, now down to turn five. Let's see if he can get late on the brakes. No, he can't. Gerard's still in second for now. As he comes to oh, the I seems, I so, I Piling on the pressure. The same He's with all over side. Uh, Albert's on the back of Karard here. Moving to the back straight. Albert's very close this time. Going up the inside into this very tight corner. Late on the brakes and Albert has got it. Albert's up to third oh, place now. Oh, going to come. Wasim's taking inside line down into the apron. Jumping on board now. Oh, and Swart Wolf on the outside. Ooh, just made it stick. Two very good overtakes there. Batted zero down in 11. Up next, but uh, for Wasim and uh, Swart Wolf. Okay, so was him finding himself in fourth place. The very good boss. Did we lose? No, it's Swartful that went back. Okay. Yes. I think I'm going to now jump on to better zero. I'm currently oh, I see him going sideways. Currently on board with Swart. Let's see if Alvarez can close the gap on Dread Severin here. Oh, Alvarez very well done from uh, Battered Zero, leaving space. For the other drivers to come past, that to lap. Okay, so oh, we've well got done. Albert good racing. 12 seconds behind Red Severin. Red, Red Severin did a very good job. Karan found himself down third. He was leading the first part of this race, doing a very good job keeping the guys behind him. And I've got Wasim currently in fourth. Part Wolf. Uh, is now in fifth place with Ezekiel in the sixth place. These guys are uh, beginning to form gaps between them. Small battles. 
here in the okay so the fourth and fifth at this stage was seem and swart will probably the closest to each other yeah and blood saint as well blood saint but not too far then they do that's all and uh, blood saint is definitely catching and it is only two seconds now one and a half seconds is the closing the cap very quick He's on the back of him as they go to the main straight here. Less than a second. Let's see. And it's Ferrari, Ferrari. No, it's Lamborghini for uh, Lamborghini Danidu. Ferrari for Danidu. Yeah, and then Ferrari for. Should they definitely have the top end or the blood saint as the cornering? Right, oh, in the back of it. The oh, then it is closing the gap. Oh, very close. There's some glitching happening here on my screen here for a second. If you guys caught that as well, that's it. Going up, that's it. Having a look, right having a look. It's having a look. He's, oh, he's gonna go to the inside of turn. He's five. gonna go on the inside, yes. But in. Running a bit wide. Bit wide. <laughs> just to keep it. Yeah. I was very close from them. It was some left, some late foot steering there. You must have been the Drake server and still with the pass up. One minute after Up to until even. Oh, drifting what? into the final corner from back to in. If you're finding it in seconds behind, so. Sort of a gap between Wasim and Swartwolf now. And uh, then do into the pits. Followed by Foley also into the pits. Phil's managed to spread out quite a bit. I'm on board with Blood Saint now. Oh, and it looks like uh, Red Severin's gone into the pits. Oh, Albert, sorry, Albert has gone into the pits. No, who's in the pits still there? I mean, it could have been Red Severin. No. Jade Severin, yeah, it has to be. Finding himself down in fourth. Out of the pits. And Swartwolf right on in. Okay, so this is Jade Severin's second pit stop then. We've got Wasim and uh, Gerard. Relatively close to each other as well. Two Lamborghinis going for uh, second place. Hey, I will see one to fast car so you can get the third place. Well, Wasim's currently in third place. Well, they still need to put where there's and they still need to put, yeah. That's uh, definitely. It's going to come into play. And 
Let's see. I'm with Albert now. Let's see if he goes into the pits. No, he stays out. And so does. Okay, well. That was seen staying out and also on. on the main straight. Now let's see. Let's see. Catch up to the back of Harrod. Well, Harrod uh, actually dropped out of first place due to the pit stop so he should still be able to go quite a distance yes sir well this lambo can also go very long shouldn't be a, a problem Oh, what's coming up to Dan to do? About to lap. Oh. Oh. Mm. Was well, he oh, not well, just over one second away from Gerard? Could be even closer now. They well, head to the hairpin here. Yeah, the gap is less than a half a second now. Carol going a tad wide out of the hairpin. I see him now on the back of him. Turning that battle. Albert is comfortable at the moment. Looking steady. On board with Wasim. Oh, and both Shout of them in goes the into the pits. Both of them. Both oh. of them into the pits. Actually, getting a and incident both into the pit there. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Dread Severin should come out. Oh, Dread Severin is already on the main straight. Is they not even in their pit boxes? Okay, let's see what Alberts does. Well, Albert's Dred Severin's also... in the pits as well. No, 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 it's Alberts in the pits. Not. Uh, Dred Severin is still out. Yeah, Dred Severin is now the lead. My screen does not show that at all. Okay, <laughs> now it does. <laughs> Looks like I've got about a 15 second delay on my stream or something. <laughs> it could be, eh? It could be. <laughs> but it literally showed Dred Severin in the pits. <laughs> I know if you check on the map, it does seem confusing sometimes. I'm blind, okay. <laughs> no, I had the same issue previously. Uh, if if you do check on the map, it, it does that. It, it uh, totally confused on who's where on the track when someone goes into the pit. Hey, let's see. But Albert's now 15 <laughs> seconds behind Dread Zoo. So it doesn't seem that they'd say Fenton is is slowing down any seconds. We've got Harad Bezen who seems still on each other. Yeah, the gap is still less than half a second. Okay, so Harad oh, Wasim should go up I'm the inside. I'm on now. Oh, just too far back. I don't think he has. He headed up the, the inside. Geez. No, you can't. Just too far back. Let's see. Uh, oh no! Oh, please don't tell no. me. Oh, this is unfortunate. And who did we lose? And we have. As a, that happens, seem going seem very wide. wide. Uh, That's the legend. Un Uncle Folly, Unfortunately. The legend. Oh, that is so unfortunate. Odd luck, Uncle Folly, but well done. First race back, doing 22 laps. We take our hats off to you, sir. So, very well done. Welcome back. Hopefully, no delay on your liking. Ah, Remington <laughs> is taking you out here on your liking. <laughs> That's supposed very to be my teammates. Eh? With teammates like that, who needs uh, enemies? <laughs> That's true, eh? <laughs> it's okay, he has to remember he starts behind the lichen. 
<laughs> You're probably gonna try and keep it as well. <laughs> uh, well, it shouldn't be too difficult to make the black and white. <laughs> I'm telling you, if my car had a better start, I would be able to keep people behind me. <laughs> but that Regera yes. goes from first on the grid to dead last within a second. <laughs> this is zero to 103 cat in a month, but then when it gets it together, it finishes the year in a couple of seconds. Uh, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. uh, unfortunately, we've seen previous lap going wide as they go into the last chicane and lost out on some time there. And yeah. has to do all the work again to get back on the Harrod Basin. Danadu now finding himself in ninth place. Uh, Yvette now in eleventh place. Eleven. And Better Zero in tenth place. Actually, not sure. Okay. Is Baktum now finding himself in eighth? Um, I don't think this track. Oh, a sim going yes. up the inside. Bears going wide. I'm gonna jump on board. Okay, so was oh, sim oh. finding himself now in third place. Bit of an incident between Dan and uh, Fred Severin and it wouldn't affect him too much though. The Dred Severin in the lonely first place, Albert in the lonely second and power sliding it all the way. Now, Gerard now, all the way from first down to fourth. Just over two pit stops. He had a very good start, managing to keep the guys behind him for a very long time. Well, I can tell you, if the guys don't look at the pit stops and they just go in on the wrong lap, we could be in for a very interesting last couple of laps. <laughs> that is true. I'm currently on board here with uh, yeah. Albert. Albert is actually one of uh, the guys racing on a wheel. I believe Danadu is well. Going very really strong. The wheel. Yes, he's doing very good. The legend's also on the wheel, right? Eh? Oh, he is. I almost forgot about that. Oh, he's also on the wheel. And uh, I believe there's another guy on, in AM Group on the wheel. Jamik, um, I can't remember what his uh, gamer tag is. <laughs> but Jamik, isn't that Justin DK? It could ah. be. I'm not sure. I have to look. No, he's also on the wheel. And that's why the photo of the legend, Uncle Foley. Doing 22 laps on the wheel, not having raced in what eight months almost. Yeah, it's it's a very long time that he hasn't raced. So doing 22 wheels, laps is a very good for. Him. Very good. I have to say, I'm I'm liking the the green that Albert's made his car. Definitely stands out. Yes. We've seen some interesting and very good liveries this uh, season with the hypercars, eh? Yes, definitely. The guys definitely had a bit of a struggle to get the cars together. Because uh, the hypercars doesn't have a lot of space to, to do the liveries on. So it was definitely a challenging time for the guys. Yeah, Gerard Bezos seemed to drop back 
maybe trying a little too hard to catch up now. Are you still finding yourself uh, down fourth oh. place? Yeah, but you can take it now a couple of seconds, that you take about a second. Oh, true, eh? He's now four seconds, or five seconds down with. Well, we've got somebody in the pits. Swart Swart Wolf, currently in the pits as well as Ezekiel. This is Ezekiel also into the pits. And he's out. The Swart Wolf exits the pits as uh, Ezekiel goes in. From the 13 guys that started, all left with so the 12. With the 11 guys, so it's a very good race from everyone. Well, looking at the championship standings, uh, with three guys currently on 54 points, uh, the one that should gain from this is uh, Albert, who's Albert. currently in second, second place. So he'll definitely create a gap again between himself and. Uh, the two following him, uh, Ezekiel and Bakhtun, uh, with Ezekiel currently finding himself, I think it was 6th or 7th place. It's a, it's a very good uh, gap. Oh, Dread Severin with a 1 minute 44.9. That. That's a very good lap. Wasim well, also into the pits now. On board with Swart Wolf at the moment. And his art lab. Currently on board with Yvette. All well, these guys left with well, eight laps. This, uh, our racing has gone oh. past quickly. <laughs> oh, and uh, the, oh. the vet actually throwing it out on the <laughs> third last corner there just before the chicane. Anything to uh, keep it going though. On the start finish straight now. Uh, okay, so just it. A blood stained. Blood being chased down by Ezekiel. The gap is only two seconds now. And eight and nine. Buck two and Dana Do also. Uh Dana Do is going into the third. So that should be his last thing. Yeah, everyone putting now should be the last bit. Yeah, well, that should put him and Bat at zero. Very close proximity when he comes out the pit. But I think Bat at zero is from which to pit again. Well, for the sake of a close race and a nice battle over the last couple of laps, let's hope not. Oh, uh, Ezekiel losing it. Okay. Oh, he, he was so close to catching up to Blood Saint. It was just over two seconds away. Oh, and then he zero loses into it. the pits now. Now where's the the divet? Has a divet pitted all three times? I divet. I divet on the. He was just uh, the final chicane now, and uh, Beta Zero is on his way out of the place. Yeah, so that means that uh, Beta Zero should still keep that ninth spot. Oh, and we've got Danadu out of the race. Uh, oh, that is unfortunate. With seven laps to go. And also, having just pit, it made his last pit. Yeah. 
Uh, Remington, who changed cars? I think everyone is in the car they started with or did the previous races, so unless for the guys uh, that didn't do the previous races. Uh, Dred Severin coming out of the pits with his last pit stop, finding himself currently in second place, but um, Albert still needs to pit again. Does he? He yes, pitted he does. before. I uh, know he needs to pit for his third uh, time. Oh, no. Nobody else out. Um, I'll have a look into that. I believe he was in the Ferrari the entire time. I'll definitely have a look into that again. And, Who's uh, that? Albert's um, Remington saying he might have been in McLaren the race before. And um, I don't think so because um, at Silverstone he definitely ran out of fuel he in the Ferrari. He ran out of fuel in the Ferrari, yes. So um, I'll definitely look at that again, but um, I'm sure he's still in the same car. Um, I actually want to bring up the dashboard. And see, no, he's still got a bit of fuel left. He's going to need to put again. Severin just coming out the pits now, so he will be full, full of juice. Gerard also pulled up. Quart was pulled. Blood sign about halfway. Ezekiel. Still, still. Fuck, Tomb also still full. Zero. As a zero, just came out of the pits, probably. And, uh, uh I think Albert might have done his three stops. If you look at his tires, only 18% for the rear. Uh, well, the tires isn't actually an issue on this track, eh? Uh, I believe we might have lost someone else here. Yeah? Yes, was was him. Him. Oh my word, was him. He was third for so long. That is unfortunate from him. Let's have a quick look. Albus is even going to have to go into the pits again. I don't think his fuel is going to make it the, on an orange bar right now. It's going to take two or three laps. It's going to be red. He definitely don't want to find himself in that problem again. Okay, let's get rid of the player info and get back to the racing so Albert is out again and we've got Red Severin Seven. actually catching him up in five seconds behind him with uh, Albert still needing to make another pit so Harold finding a Harold. bit of fortunate luck with um, Wasim, Wasim disconnecting. So he's finding himself back up to third again. And, he will and in a very lonely up. third as well. <laughs> I got blood saying country. Fifth. Fifth. Trying to chase down part of all. 27th. Ezekiel finding six. Well, this race says if anything or if nothing else definitely been interesting oh for sure and it, uh, it lays a good foundation of um, tomorrow night 
you, bro. And next week, uh, play with the pro guy. If you're gonna listen. Yeah, I'm nervous as hell for tomorrow's race. Is that because you haven't that... practiced yet? <laughs> uh, various reasons, but <laughs> the practicing, I was actually busy practicing when uh, then uh, comes the call for the accommodating. I'm like, yeah, let's do that. We can come down and watch him Ah, uh, thanks for joining on the last minute. <coughs> Admin having some issues with uh, connections and some def technical difficulties. Uh, just not been going in our way tonight. Uh, I'm glad we could get the guys racing and the stream going. Well, keep me out of the stream uh, while the commentating tomorrow because uh, I'm sure there will be some uh, <laughs> colorful language. <laughs> no, definitely will do. Uh, we've got Remington saying he is excited and nervous for the race. Yeah, it's, um, we need to put in some laps after this, uh, Mr. Remington. <laughs> <laughs> well, I need to see if I can keep up with you. I can tell you that. <laughs> Got a rough day again tomorrow, so yes, I'll be dreaming while you guys uh, do your practice. Uh, we've got Yvette still currently down in ninth place, but keep on going. Um, I mean, as the guys are disconnecting, he is picking up in places. Uh, picking valuable points. Definitely points that he would need from this race. We've got Batter um, Zero currently Bat in zero eighth. Bat Zero in 8th. down in 7th. Still scoring some points. Yeah, he, he's not happy with with the um, with the way the car's handling around this track. And, uh, I totally agree with him. Um, I've even been struggling around this track. And not finding the grip that I'm supposed to find. So yeah, it's a bit of practicing. And then uh, we've got uh, Ezekiel finding himself in six. But making some silly mistakes again. Uh, last time out in Silverstone, he could have won the race. And then on the second last lap, he actually uh, spun around and, and threw away the yes, lead. Yes, and gave away the lead, yeah. And I see those same silly mistakes are still following him today as well. Made some unforced errors. Um, so yeah, you'll definitely want to work on that. And then we've got... I think lights. it all just boils down to experience as well. I, I think it's... You can put in as many laps you want. And starting out, because he's one of our noobs with, the, with our racing. Yeah, that is true. So it's, yeah. uh, it's all, you can put in as many laps you like. I know, and I just started as, out as well, about two years ago. Her lap times were looking great running pro times and then it comes to the race and you're like six seconds behind the leaders yeah. per lap almost the yeah. racing just it's the nerves that gets to you yeah that's something that comes with time so i mean even myself when i started the racing yeah it was it wasn't sunshine and rose well the first race was sunshine and roses um but i mean to to have gotten there it took a lot of practice i was practicing day and night and i was doing online lobbies day and night just to get those nerves away and uh, start feeling the pressure and building on that and keeping the lines lap after lap it, it took a lot of time to get that right so yeah, heads off to the hats off to the to these guys uh with their practice and so on just uh, keeping the composure now that's coming next. Yeah, it's all just going to come with those wheel time, as we call it, huh? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. We've got Bloodstained also back uh, in the group uh, after a bit of absence. He's currently finding himself fifth in this race. And Swart Wolf, he uh, was battling for the lead at the early stages of the race. And uh, he's dropped down, down to fourth now, but some good points that he will be picking. I'm currently on Albert. It's in second. 
Albus is now 22 seconds behind the leader. Um, currently on Harrod Base, finding himself third place with two laps to go. Once again, very solid drive so far from uh, Red Seven. Yeah, definitely. He, uh, definitely lay down a, a marker here and uh, for the guys to chase. And uh, I'm sure even some of the the semi-pro guys will be looking at that time and uh, trying to figure out how they're going to do that time because it's a 1 minute 44. 4.9. Yeah, so it's... it's yeah. Uh, it's a very, very good time. Um, definitely. I was going to see, I think we've got Blood Saint in the pits currently. So we've got Ezekiel coming to take fifth place from Blood Saint. That's unfortunate. On the last lap. Yes, on the, well, second last lap for him. Um, and we've got Dread Severin now on the final lap. I'm going to jump on board well, with Ezekiel him is I am on board with him. He's right behind Ezekiel on the last lap. Trying to lap him, that is. <laughs> Trying to lap him, yes. Okay, let's see if he can. Uh, let's see how he does this last lap. Giving him the Hollywood cans as he finishes the race. Ezekiel shouldn't be in his way because the car should be posted. Ezekiel still staying out the way. Uh, so this race so far from what I've seen is a couple of times where the leaders came up to back markers and the back markers actually gave, way, gave so more than enough space for the leaders to come through. It's very respectful racing, very well done. No, that is very good racing. Okay, so we've got Remington saying you are on the Reaper practicing. You guys should enjoy it. <laughs> mm. now we've See got if I can take the like and to spank a bit of a, fal a Vulcan there. <laughs> we've got Red Severin coming through the chicane. Final corner now onto the main straight. A well done, Red Severin. Well done. A very well deserved win. Congratulations, man. We've got Alberts uh, now. Alberts coming seconds. over in seconds. Coming through the chicane now. Into the final corner. Still a very solid second place. Very, very good valuable from points. Him. Yes, definitely. Should find himself a couple of points clear up again. Yeah, he should be in the lead of the championship again. And Gerard Bess with a very good drive himself. Picking up some pieces of guys be dropping out of the the lobby. Gerard Bess finding himself in third place. Final corner coming over the line. Complete the podium. Well done to the top three guys there. And then Swart Wolf uh, coming around the final corner. Fourth. Crossing the line. A very good driven fourth place. We go back straight. Ezekiel grabbing fifth place on the last lap. We will definitely east of that. Now. There we go, and good, but a strong finish. <laughs> Is he drifting it over the line. <laughs> you mean crashing it over the line? Uh, blood Saint power sliding on in the lo through the last turn, and also throwing a very nice handbrake. 360 <laughs> into the wall, and parking it on the wall. <laughs> We've got Baktum currently in 7th place. 
coming around. Let's see if we make it three in a row doing that. <laughs> Buckton will just be happy with completing this track. He's, yeah. Yeah, he's just throwing it straight. <laughs> and Divet South. He'll be glad this race is over and done with. And we've got Battered Zero in uh, eighth place. And Divet in ninth. And that's uh, everybody. No, oh, we're just waiting uh, for well, the... Nobody should be a lap behind. No, it's... Uh, uh, everybody's it's on the lead lap. It's no, now Zero there. still has to... Yeah, and... Eight and nine still have to finish the race. That's correct. That's why they didn't uh, give us a bit of a spectacle across the finishing line. They was obviously still racing. <laughs> okay, well done to uh, Better Zero. I just went a bit. And also then we have to say that most of the guys in the field tonight had their first race of the series. Yeah, there's a lot of guys uh, finding themselves back in the group. Oh, oh David oh, losing and it in the final corners. Ooh, going through the chicane, just managing to keep it going there. So we're going all sideways there. But it should tell him a message telling him that you drift out of a corner, not into it. <laughs> David crossing the line in ninth place. Finally. Well done to the guys uh, finishing well done, the boys. race. Just to run through the standing, through the uh, final results. We've got Red Severin in first, Albert, followed by Gerard Bez, Bart Wolf, Ezekiel, Batsain. Buckboom, uh, Battered Zero, Yvette as the guys that finished the race and then unfortunate the uh, DCs from Wasim, Danadu, uh, Uncle Folly and Justin DK with that remote controller failure that is so unfortunate for these things to happen but well done for the guys completing the race. Definitely a good race. Yeah. Congrats, gents. Uh, it's been fun, Mr. Ice. Yeah, thanks for, for jumping on board, uh, Reaper. Enjoyed having you on board, yeah. And uh, for the rest of the guys, can, uh, enjoy the rest of the evening. Well, that's uh, some testing for me. Yeah. It's <laughs> see if I can get uh, into the 44s. I think that's going to be the, the bar for tomorrow. <laughs> Most probably is. Yes. But yeah, enjoy your practicing and uh, guys, thanks for joining and sticking it out with us even we started late. Thank you guys and uh, enjoy the rest of the evening. Thanks, man. Cheers.